Hello everyone, it's Andrea and thanks for joining me today in the Babe Cave and welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel if you're new here. I am starting a series called Bags on a Budget and this is episode one of bags under $30. So if you're interested in any of that, then stay tuned. So the first bag we have is a dupe because it's not a replica. It has no uh, Louis Vuitton, anything like that on this bag. And this bag came from Walmart and it's under $30. And it looks, it's a bum bag and it has the little clover type and then fake, this is not real Vachetta leather. But here's the top handle. It, it's it's made exactly as the as what you call a dupe is because it's made exactly like another bag. And there's a zipper in the back. And this ba back pocket will hold your 12 Pro Max easily. So just wanted to show that it has pretty gold hardware. I don't know what this dangly thing is. If anyone knows, I don't know what you do with that. So let me know if you know. <laughs> um, but yeah, it has, you know, it has this red glazing, which, you know, I don't, I wish that was a, a, a darker, <laughs> but it's still pretty, you know, and it's under $30. It has, you know, adjustable strap. It has one, two, three, four, five. Let me make sure. Yeah, five adjustments. And then you can also adjust it on this side to make it longer. So it is a awesome bum bag when you can pay under $30 and get the look for less, then I think that's a great deal. Um, so let me show you the inside of this zipper while we're here, because I don't think I ever showed you this bag, but I love carrying it. It is super comfortable against your body. It lays flat, but here's the interior. It holds, you know, phone. If you wanted to put your phone or if you want to put wallet, keys, you know, everything fits in this bag. It has one slip pocket and like this kind of a silky brown material. And then there's a zipper pocket in the back and sorry about that but yeah it is a nice dupe for the Louis Vuitton bum bag and it ha even has the double zippers that you can put you know back up to the front oh. the zippers work really good I mean everything about it it's it's nice for 30, under $30, you can get this bag, which I'll have all my 30 and under bags linked below in the description box. So feel free to shop away and click on the links because I promise you, you can get all these five bags under $30. So this bum bag is number one. This is bag number two and it's just the white checkered print. Uh, I believe I got this before they changed the interior. This is also from Walmart. Um, unfortunately, it has that red interior that has bled through. So I may get another one. And I'll, I'll link the ones below. Because they don't have this red interior now that this one bled through, unfortunately. But it looks a lot like the Louis Vuitton favorite mm that that's what this size is for reference um you know you get the look for less again no markings of anything it's no name a nice gold chain that you could use as a shoulder strap but and then let me open it up for you it has a it has a magnet right here that magnetizes and then here's again the red 
<laughs> glazing. Not my favorite. Wish it was darker, but it, it is what it is. Um, but yeah, same, you know, same color strap as that bum bag. It's an, got a lot of adjustments to it. It has one, one, two, three, four, five adjustments for the crossbody strap. And both of these straps are detachable. So you don't have to have both of them on at the same time. And like I said, here's this interior that bled through to the white part, which is very disappointing to me. But now I think they make these with a cream color fabric. So make sure when you're looking at the link of, you know, the reviews and uh, if it's a cream interior, then it won't do this bleeding that mine did. I still, you know, I still use it. It's still a good run around town, quick grab and go, but it just has the one slip pocket and it like a, this is like a maroon color. But yeah, it's, it feels, this feels like canvas to me. It feels like Louis Vuitton canvas without paying the big bucks. So this is number two and it's the white checkered that looks like the favorite MM. We're sticking with Walmart because I got these first four that I'm going to show you at Walmart. And again, they're all under $30. And this looks very familiar. And I've gotten compliments on this bag. <laughs> and people assume that it's Louis Vuitton. Even though there is absolutely no logos. They, you know, don't pay attention that much. And I really like this white checkered. And there has been no bleeding because you'll see from the interior as to why it this one is is perfect. Um, and if you do order these Walmart bags, there might be a slight smell in the beginning. But now they have no smell. Though they go away within a week or two is my, my experience on it. But here's the top handle. Easy grab out of the car and go. And then the hardware is just like the Pochette Matisse Louis Vuitton. So you just click that, it opens up. And then there's the interior. And then the strap is the matching white checkered print. I have no complaints. This bag holds a lot. Just like the Coach Cassie's, the full size, it's amazing. Like... I'm, I'm pretty sure that if I had the funds, I would get the real Pochette Matisse because I would use it because these are so functional. But again, this is under $30, has a nice back zipper, which we all love, for your cell phone. So yeah, this, again, great purchase, especially for summertime. And like I said, I've gotten compliments on this bag. And people assume that it's Louis Vuitton, and Louis Vuitton doesn't make a white uh, Damier Azor in this, in, in Pichette Matisse. So, there is number three. Number four, yes, this is a, also a recent purchase. This is amazing. This one's my favorite. I really do wish uh, Louis Vuitton would do this print as well, because... I would probably, I would really consider buying it. But this is only, this is under $30. Again, it's like the one I showed you before. Um, except it's in the brown checkered print. Again, it's on Walmart for under $30. here is the top handle. Everything about it, same back zipper, just the same. Zippers work amazing. Hardware pops right open. Uh, uh, some stuffing. <laughs> uh, that is, you know, back in the day, you used to wear pantyhose. <laughs> uh, I used those for stuffing, so. Anyway, uh, same uh, it has the brown checkered, you know, that matches for the crossbody strap. Just a brown fabric interior. Love this bag. I used it a lot already. Here's the sides. I can't complain. 
I mean, the quality is amazing for $30, and it's a very functional, popular bag. It's still, I still think it is. I mean, you may have a different opinion, but, you know, it's it's a great dupe. <laughs> so, that is number four. And last, this is my last one from Walmart. This is my The Tote Bag, you know, dupe. Because there is no Marc Jacobs anywhere on it. As you, if, I'll link my other video of this bag when I uh, opened the box. Um, also, I did a what's in my bag and I'll, I'll link both of those. But yeah, look at the embroidery. And this was on their website is under $30. The company, it, I'll, of course, link them down below, but it's L-A-S-N-V. This is yellow pleather, I want to say, like, fake leather, <laughs> P-U. But it's really made very functional. The only um, downside for me is, well, it doesn't have feet on the bottom. Um, and But it's very comfortable, it's denim. And under $30, okay, this is something I didn't notice before, is this zipper, somehow they didn't cut it off here, and it goes to the edges. I don't, never seen that before, but, I mean, the zipper works really good. It's cheap, you know, but I'd say the Walmart hardware was a little more substantial than this silver stuff, but, yeah, it, I never seen little, the zipper go all the way, but... Yeah, so this is under 30. Let me show you the strap again. And then there's the pocket inside. I couldn't get out of this bag. It's so comfortable to carry. But yeah, it's just this this strap right here with the yellow, you know, PU leather. and I forget what this is called. Fabric, you know, nylon strap. But yeah, dark interior. I couldn't get out of this bag, so, um, I don't, you know, stay in bags too long, but this one, I like the patchwork, the denim, I wear denim all the time, I'm either in workout clothes, or I'm in denim, and a t-shirt, <laughs> I'm not a dressy type of girl, I'm a jeans and t-shirt type of gal, um, from the Midwest, <laughs> so, I hope you enjoyed this first episode that I'm getting out to you for bags under $30. So stay tuned for the next episode. And um, I'm going to just work my way up budget wise. And uh, I hope that you enjoy that kind of content because, you know, not everyone can afford thousands of dollars for a bag. And so I want to show different options for different budgets. So I hope you appreciate it, and I uh, ho hope it helps you out if you're looking for something like that. And I, until next time, next episode will be episode two, and it will be uh, $30 to $50 bags. So stay tuned for that one. And don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and comment which one's your favorite, or do you, did you buy any of these? And let me know. If you have any questions, I will be happy to answer them. And until next time, bye.